So we've come today to join Costco. Yep. Um, I don't know if we're allowed. I work for the NHS, so I'm assuming I'm allowed. You said I was, didn't you, yeah. Fred? When I worked for the NHS, um, I had one. I've never joined Costco. I've only ever been once with Isabel. Um, so we're hoping that we can join in and just go in there today, yeah. but I'm not 100% sure. So if you don't know about joining Costco... It's probably... an American concept um, where you pay. Oh. We used to have Sam's Club in America, I think, and Price Club, and I think Costco took them over, oh, or one right. of them over at least. Oh. Uh, yeah, so it's where you can buy things in bulk and stuff. You used to get big blocks of cheese or hot wings. I'm get not about a big... like a big bag of hot wings. Like I'm not a big fan of buying things in bulk, but you love it, don't you? Well, you don't run out, do you? Yeah. Uh, anyway, we're just. We're just curious, we just want to go and have a look. It's, I think it's £33 a year membership. But um, because I've got a blue light card, it says that you get £10 of that back to spend. So really, what's that noise? Oh, um, the tyre place. Oh, they have tyre place? Well, it's not Costco, it's a different company. Oh, are we in the wrong No, no park? it's just around the corner. It's oh. right there, Costco's there. Where? That building there is Costco behind so we there. we walk around there, yeah, do we? I'm thinking so, yeah. Oh, we don't even know where we're going. Anyway, if you're interested in joining Costco and you don't know what to do, it might be handy to stay tuned in this video because yeah. we haven't got a clue. So I'm going to take my work ID and my passport I've got with me. And your blue light card. And my blue light card to get that pound. offer. And I'll let you know how it goes. Won't we? Yep. Hopefully they get some good deals. <laughs> <laughs> I really want that, do you? Yeah. Really nice. Should we look round first? What yeah. does this do? Just a flickering effect and so. So we've joined. It's only a thousand pounds. We've joined and we're in here. We've ended up joining the executive programme yeah. for an extra forty pounds. Fred's idea. You get two percent. But you get it back and you get money back each time. So Fred's looking at the TVs. I found it eighty-five in. 85 inch. You like that one? Much better. It is thin. It's only like 100 pounds more than what I paid for other Is one. it? 819. Yeah. We won't get Fred away from the TVs now. He was really pleased because the lady, for the first time ever, the lady recognised that he was American. Doesn't happen all the time, does it, Fred? Do you remember these stationary sets? used to have these in my day. You got that Oxford oh, yeah. tin. So, so far our trolley is just full of... Crap. Crap. We do have some milk. <laughs> We've got pizza. a huge big pizza and a pack of pizzas. And then look at these. We've got some dreamy uh, lick licks for the cats. Ooh. And then Fred's just this found, oh, Fred's got loads of alcohol. Price here. Normally it's 20 quid, 10 pounds for just one angle. Then we pull it out. Hey, you get 12 Colgates for £8.49. We get it. <laughs> that pizza is massive. Look at the size of them. We've got peanut butter pretzels. Normal pretzels. Got normal pretzels. We just got junk. It was nice fruit and vegetables. Next time we need to look properly. Yeah. We did get a lot of good deals on the Pepsi. It's like six pound for a big, wasn't Excluding it? Excluding that. Then you got to pay like twenty percent tax or something on it. Twenty percent. I'm not sure what it is. I was just estimating. I thought it was like thirteen or something. Oh, it's not too bad. Cat's got a treat. Cat's got them. Is it all going to fit in the... Uh, this is our treat. This is what... I got that idea from Isabel. How much was that? 20 something pounds? Yeah. Call this alcohol. Do you think this is the majority of the bill? No, the pizzas. The pizzas? Can't be the pizzas. It's a joke. Oh. I don't understand your milk. jokes. That's not the only useful thing we got. Look at the popcorn. That'll last me forever. The they look nice. Oh, this was a good deal. Six quid. 
Yeah. Or 549. Yeah. Like Some of the things said they weren't including that if you looked. Oh, did it? Yeah. And then we got mustard. I mean, it's a bit of a, a battery jumble sale. Oh. And we got all those coal gates that Fred was excited about. Vegetarian hot dogs. And that's that. What are you doing? Getting your bags out. So yeah, I don't know whether Costco is going to be worth it, but we've joined now. Um, <laughs> we've joined now, there's no going back. And we bought loads of junk. I mean, I suppose all that alcohol Fred's bought would come to more, probably. But um, the shopping did come to quite a lot. Um, yeah, so that's our first experience in Costco. Um, I really wish I got that Disney thing. It was 80 pounds. They have many of those Disney things, Fred. Oh, he's not listening. Oh. Did you have fun in Costco? Yeah, it wasn't too bad. Quite a lot of things. Quite a lot of things. But we had fun. We didn't have fun. Oh, the vodka was £29. Oh, was it? Oh, yeah, we knew that. Yeah. So I think it said 27 dollars so it's not much more they put on. I still can't believe the Whispering Angel, only 13 quid. Mm, yeah. Um, so we're starving now, we didn't, we couldn't be bothered getting a slice of pizza. Didn't look very nice um, to be It fair. looked a bit dried up, didn't it? So we've got that big pizza, we're going to put that in when we get in, aren't we? Are we? Yeah. Um, yeah. I don't, I don't tell you how much you pay for that. Um, oh yeah, it's 20% VAT. Oh, 20%, that's a lot. So it came to 168 and we paid 20 pounds on tax. Oh. What we're gonna do? We have a big pizza pie. What are we gonna do? Put it on two trays. Well, I think you should just put it straight into the oven tray. But it'll fall through the cracks, won't will it? it? Mm. Yeah. I don't okay. think it will. Huh? Just make it a bit more. We haven't tidied up in the kitchen and we're filming. In it goes. Oh. It's not fitting. I don't think it's a good idea. I'd just slide it on the tray. I could put it on one. Oh. Well, it takes up the whole coffin. Oh my god. Kirkland Signature Artisan Pizza. It was $7.49. It's huge. Apparently, it's got five cheeses. Um, God knows what they are. Five cheeses. Yeah. So we're going to try butter these. Peanut butter pretzels. Peanut butter pretzels. Okay. It is a big jar. Yeah. Imagine if they're horrible and we're stuck mm, with these. Mmm. Peanut butter. Mm. I can see the peanut butter in yours. Yeah. Come on, one. It's not ready. One, one two, two, three. three. Down the hatch. Mmm. It's all like humbles. Mmm. That is nice. The peanut butter is more like um, powdery. Mmm. The peanut butter is more like powdery. Powdery. Quite thick peanut butter, I mm, think. Nice though. They're nice, they're quite salty. They're a bit like those sticks you used to mm. get. Oh yeah, they are. Where do we used to get those from? Oh, home bargains. Mmm. Mmm. Get these again. They look nice though. Looks really good, doesn't it? We should have got two. Not for now. For one for another. Does that look in the middle? Uh, not really. It is, is it? I don't know. Hello, it's another day. Just going to have a look at what Fred's been doing in the garage. Hello. Hello. Oh, very good. Oh. Mm -hmm. Almost done. The only thing is, I miscalculated the wood. So the yeah. bottom one, I have to go this way instead of a long ways. Well, 
Good, isn't it? Quite sturdy. Mm, shake it. It does a bit better with the floor <laughs> Yeah, I know. Yeah. It'll be soon time to get all the Halloween decorations yeah. out. Well, that's Christmas. Where are all the Halloween? Um, it's all it's all there somewhere mixed together. You keeping those cupboards? For now, yeah. Green, don't they? What's that grey box up there on the top? Oh, it's an electric box, like oh. outdoor electrics. Oh, they're just it's just there. Yeah, I can't find my big screws. Mm. Oh God. This, if I put this cross here, I got one, two, three, so I got four, and then I got here, probably get another four out of there. Yeah. So hopefully, what are you going to put on now. all these shelves? Hmm, tools. Oh. And stuff storage. And the fridges are going under there. Right there yeah. yeah. Good. Very good. Hello. Oh, the big spruce. What? I've seen them in a bag. Did you move any bags from over there? No. Going to see what the pumpkins are doing. I had grown one. Did I tell you? It snapped off. I'll have a look now. That little plant never seemed to grow. I can't see any, but the plants are like humongous. We're trying to make the bed. We've got a surprise. We've got a surprise. Somebody's actually right in there. What are you doing? Come on. Mini Bully, you silly Billy. <laughs> Mini. So today, here's the pumpkin patch. There's loads of flowers on it, and I've just uh, found out that you're meant to pollinate your pumpkins because they don't pollinate themselves; they have to be pollinated. Um, so I've just got a brush, and I've taken some pollen off this male flower. Can you see him? And I'm going to find a female flower, which I hope I've got one. I think this is one that's come off the edge. Here, yeah, look, can you see that lump? That's a female. Oh, that's a bee. They should be pollinating these for me. So I'm going to find her bit, which is there. Brush it on. We do it again. So there, an open one here. That's a male flower. That one. Pull that off because it's rotted.
the morning. I'm up on my day off because I've taken Fred to work. Um, we just left all Fred. I've been at work for the last two days, and so Fred's in charge of the cooking then because he gets home first. And he, all the dishes have been left, so I'm just clearing up the kitchen. I'll show you messy kitchen. We clear it up, and Mickey's just keeping me company down here. I've got to hoover and everything. And we've got this dirty old feather that's been bought in on the outside, haven't we, Mickey? We're proud of that, aren't we? Yes, we are. Good boy. Um, so as you all know, I've been having trouble with Mickey and this reactions that he's, he's got this. I'll have to put the name on the screen because I can't say it, but he's got this disorder, which means he's going to be hypersensitive to a lot of things um, and it's a bit of a stress really because they can't tell us what it is that he's allergic to. There's usually flea bites and things like that and when I think back, I can't remember if I did a video of when they were kittens and we first got them and they got, they were covered in fleas and I've never dealt with fleas before and it was horrendous. It would have made a really good video but I can't, I don't think I vlogged about it. Um, and at that time he had like all ball patches at the back of his legs and scabs and I just assumed it was flea bites and he'd over groomed um, because of the fleas but when I think back now he was probably having a big this reaction it was just lucky it didn't develop in uh, like these others that he's had recently anyway somebody from work Daryl um, really kindly brought me in some of these um, Nature's Choice, I think it is it called. Nature's Menu. Nature's Menu for cats. That's complete and balanced, so it's natural. Um, it's in broth, they love broth. Um, chicken and salmon and tuna. Um, yeah, and is this one they say? Yeah, there's another one. He brought me four of them, it was so kind of him. I was really touched. Um, chicken and turkey in this one. So they tried chicken and turkey and they ate it last night. So I'll try them with this one. And it was so kind of Daryl to bring these in for me at work because um, they're, they're quite expensive, these natural ones. So at least if I know I've tried them, it's not a waste of money. Um, look at that cute cat on the front. Uh, it looks like Garfield that comes and visits... Uh, the cats. So let's try, let's see what they think of chicken, salmon and tuna and then I'm probably going to get pop to Jolly's and buy some of this um, if they eat the both flavours. I don't know if I showed you these little pet dishes they got, well I got for them. It was two, we got two in a set for seven pound I think. And um, I think he's going for his dinner, you're not supposed to be up here Mickey. Um, are you hungry? Yeah, they were two for seven pounds and TK Maxx, but you have to be careful because they weren't together. It's only, it was when I was with Isabel, we saw start, they came as a set. And the lady at the till said, oh, I thought they were seven pounds each. And I was like, no, it's a set. It does say on the label. So if you see them, they kept the pet dishes in TK Maxx. Just be careful because some of them do come as a set. They're not individual. I've ordered two Halloween dishes, sorry. I've ordered two Halloween dishes, Ray Dunn ones off the website. I hope they come. I've done it for Click and Collect today. So hopefully they'll come. It looks like this, it's sort of like a pate one. But they do eat it. There was one time when they wouldn't eat pate, but they, they've gobbled this one up, so it must be good stuff. What do you think of that, Mickey? Are you having that for your breakfast? He said put some in the dish. Put some in the dish. Quick, put some in the dish. And as you can see, he loves it. So thanks for that, Daryl. That was so kind. Um, and he hasn't had any reactions lately, so I'm hoping this change of diet will help. He's loving that one. Hope you enjoyed this weekly vlog, and I will see you again next week i suppose or whatever it is i don't really do them like set weeks i just do a week whenever maybe i'll do at least one weekly vlog a month it's quite hard now back at work 
to sort of fit everything in. Um, but yeah, we'll do another one soon and there'll be loads of Halloween hauls and, and, and vlogs coming up soon as well. So take care. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.